That is so funny. By the way, shall we watch this? Streamers at Kitchen on Fire, I said. I've seen something on Twitter before on this. I haven't looked too much into it, so let's... Let... Let's let... Let y'all... Yesterday, fighting. a streamer set her Something. kitchen on fire, and it was dangerously close to just becoming like a crematorium. It got out of control quickly Lovely. and was handled in the worst possible ways by two people there. But I should react to Kitsudera's videos? Yeah, I think so. Except for the kitchen. That that took a beating. They got, The kitchen got walloped. Unlucky. Bro. Why is she streaming in that outfit, man? Why is she streaming in this outfit? It starts so innocent. Simply cooking in your lingerie You know lingerie why she is. Yeah, but why? A time we can all you relate know? to. I can't even remember the last time I went into my kitchen and tried to whip up some fucking spaghetti without my bare <laughs> butt know, cheeks like, hanging out. Yeah, I, I, I know money, but still, you know, why? Like, why? <laughs> Like deep down, why? Now, why would you do yourself, this? What mystery cuisine is she in the process of preparing here? When I was first watching she doesn't the clip, because the clip that went viral is about a minute long, but I wanted the whole kitten caboodle, so I went to like most of this segment here, and Let's I go. really thought that she was just playing with condoms and milk. I didn't know what it was. I thought it was some kind of weird science experiment. Turns out they're pickles. So she was going to what? fry some pickles and. Everything what happened to his camera? Quick. The camera. I that. Microphone. I don't like pickles. <laughs> because she's not interesting, she knows it's uh, so she's farming the thirsty boys. Oof. Oof. Not everyone can be uh, as interesting as Kitsunero out here, right? Am I, am I right, boys? She looks hella excited streaming in that outfit. She looks so uninterested. Her face looks like someone made her do that. She looks like... She doesn't even want to be there. Daily sub goes 0 out of 69! Uh -huh. I've never had them fried before. Oh. Is that pen empty? Narcissist, but not untrue. <laughs> oh, what the hell did I come into? To Genius! Is this okay to react to? <laughs> Is this okay to react to? <laughs> what is this? I mean... Oh, oh. I don't. Oh. I don't know. I don't care. <laughs> Just cover her. Um, is this even T U S? I oh, no. would have loved more if her butt was as flat as her fraud. <laughs> Unlurk. Hello. That's <laughs> like this is flashy, but not V two. Uh, but that's I true. Down? I don't know anything about this. I've never done this before. I've never fried them before. Holy shit, I think the oil might be ready though. I don't even know anymore. I don't know why, yeah, but man. Just... Oh, I hate I the know. smell of burning. Uh, maybe I'll just uh, keep moving myself in front of her ass every time she moves around. Charlie reacted to her. Yeah, but did he do it the live on stream? The cracks are already starting to show, and I'm not just talking about her ass. So the dude over there is like, is something burning? What's going on over there? Holy uh, shit, did we get invaded recovered. by a smoke demon? Why is this happening? What what's what in tarnation? And you can see she's over there with a giant puff of smoke like a ninja vanishing with a- I'm gonna be honest. After she turned around, I stopped focusing on the stove. <laughs> when she was turned around, I stopped focusing on the stove. <laughs> <laughs> smoke bomb and it's only going to get worse 
So she's talking about how she's never fried anything before, so she doesn't really know what she's doing. She's kind of winging it. And I recognize I'm no culinary expert myself. Oh, no. Oh, that is so bad. Oh, that is so bad. Oh, no. It's a caught legging, literally. (laughs) Literally. We can all agree on that. But I would say... Why not just look up a quick tutorial on, like, the steps to take? Literally! You know, just glance at like, we- literally do? Hey, Ziri! Hey, Ziri! Wie frittiere ich etwas? There we go! Already have the answer! Ricky, <laughs> how? So that way you might be able to prevent dying in a fiery doom. Like, we have technology. Wait! That shit is smoking so much! Oh no! No, woman! It's on fire! It's on fire! Turn it off! Turn it off! What do I do? Bro, turn it off! Turn it off! Tanner, hurry up! Turn it off! Honestly, just oh another god. great example of how detrimental panicking in a situation oh is. Oh my god, they're when going. You let fear take the Why wheel. Why is he not wearing laundry? <laughs> so she just starts yelling about how she doesn't know what to do. So she's frozen. She's out of the game, basically. She she yeah. is on the bench now and is a spectator. She is no longer participating in trying to solve this issue that has been created. <laughs> you know, as she's sitting there saying she doesn't know what to do, the fire is Let's spray water getting right into stronger. The but yeah, the yeah, don't do that. Building up power. And now it's up to Tanner here <laughs> to take nation. control, but he's also panicking. So he he's also, also just know. sitting there watching it. Now, Fire Marshal Charles here, what they should have done, the optimal solution here would be put just a to lid put a on, lid it. on it. That, that would is, have been checkmate right then and there. Look at me, Chad. Look at me. I'm so smart. I'm so smart. I'm so smart. Hell. <laughs> But let's say there was no lid for this pan. The previous night, a burglar broke in and stole it. Well, take you can a use plate! Salt. It takes a lot of salt, but you can use, like, a few handfuls of salt on a small grease fire like this, and it will extinguish the flame. Grab! 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 This absolute cinema, by the way. This is actually absolute cinema. Idiots get what they fucking deserve, you know? Oh, this actually... I... I started enjoying the show. I really started enjoying the show. They're both fucking retarded. OF people get what they fucking deserve at times, you know? What are you streaming if you can't cook? Literally! Why are you doing a cooking stream if you can't cook? It's not too bad entertainment. Yeah, yeah, like... <laughs> this is... This is perfect cinema. Tanner, I love is this. Is it? Oh my god! Tanner! Tanner! I don't know what it is! It, it dropped the That was a freaking fireball! Is it? Oh my god! Tanner! Tanner! I don't know what it is! It, it dropped the extinguisher! Tanner! Well, fire's off. And it- you know what? <laughs> if it works, it works, right? <laughs> interesting decision that ended up working out so he ran in there and slapped the pan down like he was casting a fireball and it basically (laughs) shotgun blasted all the grease and fire across the kitchen and it burnt everything that it touched but the fire didn't spread so it didn't burn the The whole building down luckily but when you're panicking you're not thinking rationally you're really not thinking at all you just start working off instinct but that's not i don't even think it's accurate to say instinct because you This wasn't even instinct, because instinctively, I would have put a fucking lid on it! (laughs) It didn't spread as the keyword. Start to go like stupid brain. Like your brain smooths out in moments of crisis, and you start making the worst If it's extremely fire as a kitchen, it would have been over. Oof. Oh, 
Oof, okay, okay. I just put the pot on the right on it. Look bigger than the pan. <laughs> they would have done that if they were smart kids, so yeah. Obviously these people ain't smart. They need to wear lingerie. Bro. Uh, bro, this guy just allowing, like, not allowing, but like, sorry, wrong choice of words. Being okay with his girlfriend or partner or whatever their relationship status really is. Like, be it married or engaged or you know what I mean. Him being okay with her doing this. Yikes. Yikes. Fucking yikes, man. I am not I'm not a good cook myself, but this is so bad. This is very bad. Maybe he made her do it, who knows? Who knows? Gotta go, it's 4 a.m. See ya. I hope not. I fucking hope not. Decisions ever. So I actually was in a kitchen fire scenario. It was never like out of control, but it was starting to get to that point. And for some reason, my little tiny reptile noodle up here thought, oh, okay, I'll just put this under water because it was small enough I could move it to the sink and pour water on it. That's actually the dumbest thing you can do. So when it comes to a grease fire, yep. you can't put Don't water that. on it. That's You're going just to make it, it worse. <laughs> You're and feeding luckily, it. I caught myself before I did that because oh. I actually probably would have burnt my whole house down. Whee! So, so nice. it's one of those things where once you lose your composure, once you stop being calm, you start making horrible choices like here. Oh, bro, all the smoke. Um, I remember when I was younger, my parents had, um... I don't think it was my parents' fault. I think it was one of my siblings' fault. Um, my parents always left, like, a pot on the stove with oil in it because my stepfather loved deep-frying fucking veggies to eat them. Fat ass. Literally. Like... French fries and then fucking what do I know? Um, eggplants and zucchini and um, um, up, 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 cauliflower, is Arabic. Uh, it's a it's a pretty common thing and for Arabs apparently, it's pretty tasty actually. But they would have always left it there. And then my younger siblings got old enough to play with the handles of the stove. And my sibling thought, yay, click, 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 it's fun, <laughs> click. Yeah, we almost had a fire hazard uh, as well in the kitchen. Like, it was pretty much that smoky. It was pretty much this smoky in the kitchen. Hey, tongs! <laughs> Are you doing? But yeah, um, after that, my parents realized, yeah, I can't have that. Can't have that <laughs> anymore. I'm good, how are you? I'm good too. I'm good too. I'm good too. She accidentally turned on her stove with over a month's worth of junk mail on it. Oh no. Oh no. I accidentally turned on the stove with like some plastic shit on it. You know, like where you accidentally turn on the wrong plate? Not the wrong plate, like the wrong stove thing. I <sighs> happened to me too with my old stove in my old apartment. Fucking melted down plastic on the stove, or almost never got all of it off. My mom used to fall asleep while cooking quite often, so I have experience putting out small fires. Oh Jesus Christ! Oh my God! Oh my God! Bro, you can't even see her, but I think that's for the best that you can't see her right now. Keep doing that, please. Hold on, guys. I might. Oh, shit. Now, I've seen a lot of people calling bullshit joke. on this, saying that it's all staged, it's a not... load of horseradish, no. you know, it's not real. They... You know, for a fact, they don't have anything in their brain. 
if they... <sighs> you know for a fact they don't got anything in their fucking brain, man. If they... They did this for views. And Just I definitely do think no. we live in a time where someone would do that. But in their case, I don't think so. Yeah. She gains nothing from it. Except having everyone shooting spitballs at her, making fun of her, and I'm... Yeah. My uh, next door neighbor in Scotland fell asleep with a cigarette in his hand and set his apartment on fire? Jesus Christ. Huh? Jesus fucking Christ, man. That is so bad. Pretty sure I heard them say that they're in an apartment and that they were about to lose the security deposit because of this because they just caused so much damage to the <laughs> Unlucky. unit here. So I feel Unlucky. like there's really nothing to gain from it unless she just has some kind of humiliation fetish and just wanted everyone to make fun of her. It'd be a really weird thing to stage. I think it's far more likely that this was a genuine instance of someone not knowing how to fry something yeah. and not knowing how to handle a grease fire. Interestingly yep. enough, it's not the first time this has actually happened on stream. Really? This is her again! Oh shit. Oh, shit. This is her! I almost couldn't tell it's her because I can't couldn't see her entire body. Oh shit, oh shit. Oh shit. Oh fuck. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Oh fuck. Fuck, fuck, fuck. I don't know what to do, guys. I don't know what to do. Shit. Help! 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 <gasps> I don't know what to do, you guys. But yeah, that's gonna help. Oh my god, that's gonna help. You see, you yelling help is gonna help. Oh my god, call the fire! Call the fire apartment, man. Call the fire department. If you don't, oh my god! Guys, I don't know what to do. Help! Yeah, help! ask. Once again. <laughs> She's asking chat. She's asking her chat. No. She's asking her chat what to do. No. Panicking almost led to a much worse situation when she ran it underwater, spread the fire more, started throwing the fire around like she was tossing out candy on Halloween, but with fire here in the kitchen. And then she's shouting for help. Like, what do you want me to do, lady? Jump through the computer and put it out myself or something? Literally. Like, come on. Point is, I don't think it was staged. Help. If it was, help. it was a really stupid help. idea because the kitchen does get really fucked up from it. Hey, like, it's Lovely. not fake. They definitely didn't CGI this on some kind of advanced soundstage. Like, they're not in a studio <laughs> where they... AI generated! it. Haters will say it's AI generated. Film The Mandalorian or anything. It'd be a really dumb thing to stage because I don't think she stands to gain very much from it regardless. But maybe there's a good lesson to be learned here for anyone that didn't know how to handle a grease fire prior to this. She didn't know 112 is available 24-7 in the US. Like, literally, isn't that available in any country ever? Like, maybe with a slightly bit different um, number, but, like, fire department is always Just available. Just don't do anything you saw them do. What you do, literally. you fucking put a lid on it if you can find one. That should be, like, your go-to strat. I think that is the tried-and-true method. It's just the optimal strategy, really. In, in my opinion, there's a couple different tactics, but I think that one's just the simplest. And of course, remain as calm as possible. I know it's easier said than done, you know, there's definitely some times where I'll be in like an emergency situation. <laughs> Fire department or stream thing. Honestly, dude, they will see that she is unfit to ever handle a fucking kitchen again. And <laughs> put her on a restraint order for her kitchen. And doing nothing productive, I'll just sit there going, ah! Like, ah, actually accomplishing help. nothing, like I- Chat, help! My location is on fire, help, 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 help! I'm a damsel in distress, help me, help me, help me! I can't call 911, help, 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 help! I'm so stupid! I'm just a silly little baby! I get it, but that's the worst <laughs> thing you can do. Just do your best to stay as composed as you can, oh. so that way you don't end up just making- Worst Stupid. choices for the situation there. That's really about it. Probably not even yeah. reading chat. Yeah, probably. Yes, probably dude. not even reading chat, man. Holy fucking shit, man. That set up more like step chat. 
<laughs> Step shed, help me, my kitchen is on fire. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Would be fun to be her neighbor. Help her, you heal through the wall. Oh, is it time again? <laughs> I bet she cooks egg in microwaves without using water bowl. Oh. oh no. Oh no. I will keep her out of the kitchen. Same. This woman does not belong in the kitchen. <laughs> this woman does not belong in the kitchen, chat. <laughs> I will go to the toilet. Um, thanks for watching, YouTubes. See you next video. Bye bye.